Hello again, this is a video about prints and how you can change them. So we click on the fabric of the pants and then we go in the property editor on the texture. There we go on the four rectangles and open our print file. And then we can here on edit texture and select the print. Um, this gizmo here appears and with it we can scale the print or click on the pants and, and rotate the grain. If you make a right click when you rotate then you can also enter a degree number. Here at Open Texture Editor, you can change even more. For example, you can change the colors. Um, first, always select the layer of the print and then go to the color switch and select how many colors you want to change. And then go to the colors and select a new one. Apply and close. And um, here at the saturation, you can make the print black and white and change the shadow of the print. And here at color, I can change the background of the print. Now I show you another variation. Um, for example, if you want to have a print that glitters, and then you can also get to print as a place print. Um, to do this, I go here to the graphic and get the PNG file, so a print without background. Then simply drag and drop on my pattern. Then I go here to this T-shirt and select the print and make it bigger. Or turn the cycle here. I have to do that um, for all patterns. Um, sometimes you have to put the pattern pieces a little further apart so that the print is on the right piece. Here at this iteration, you can make the print black and white again and set your own color. And this is the cool thing, I think. Um, you can go to type here and choose how your print should look like. Um, shiny or plastic or glitter. Um, but some of this filters you can see only in the render window. I rendered a part briefly so you can see it. Or you can make a place print with a shirt. And then right click on it and select tile and then X axis then it repeats like this or in Y axis and then it repeats vertically. Um, or pattern then it's everywhere. But there's also another possibility you can also create an all over print. Um, to do this, I go to the fabric of the shirt and add print and then I select my print again. Then it's automatically distributed on the shirt. You have to select the print layer and then you can change the repeat type in the property editor.
or you go to the texture editor and then you can determine the spaces even better or transform the print. You can make your own repeat type. And then apply and close and you're done. If you have any questions, feel free to write them in your comments and, and subscribe my channel for more.